My name is Onas of Knowledge. I study math, well I studied math and engineering physics at UV. Um, a prospective graduate. I uh, graduated in class 2019. I was the, um, the past president of the Student Government Association, past vice president and Senate speaker. Um, also the past senator for the, for the National Society of Black Engineers. Uh, student government, that was, the student government is like a like practical version of like Toastmasters. Um, you just go in there and you start speaking. I was able to advocate for and promote welfare and just of all the students and all of that, that advocacy stuff. <laughs> it was pretty fun. Um, it taught me how to plan corporate events. It taught me how to chair meetings, run meetings, create agendas. Yeah, it, was, it was pretty good. Um, I, um, I was interested, initially interested in studying and becoming a robotics engineer and an astronaut. So I knew I had to do something related to mechanical and electrical um, engineering. So I came to UB in the mechanical engineering program, mechanical engineering technology program. And well, when I looked at the when I looked at the contract, it wasn't um, up to my standard uh, of what I needed to get there. So I changed my major to mathematics, and I decided to use a little bit of engineering classes as my electives. And then, as fate would have it, UB offered the the dual degree program, so I ended up going inside it. So I used those skills. I changed my um, my field to from robotics engineering to, to data science, and I'm still on the path to also becoming an astronaut. I had a few. My favorite ones were the first UB Lit and the first um, leadership retreat at Eleutheron. I like the UB lit event because you know you focus so hard on on planning the event, and when all of this big crowd shows up, that was like that was the biggest party that has ever happened since I since I've been to UB, and it was it was pretty fun to be a part of that. Um, all the fireworks and the cake going on the stage, chanting, all of that stuff. Especially since we first charted too, it was really nice. <laughs> I would get into <laughs> the other stuff we did, but you know it was it was a great event. For the leadership retreat, the leadership retreat was really good because. Um, that was the first time I met Joe, Mr. Tucson, and Darren. And then when they put us in the cabins, I met like some of the greatest, the greatest guys I ever knew. And I'd do anything for them. That's still at Avion, Aaron, Kyle, Brian, and, and Wentworth, and Leo, all of them. It helps a lot. You know, how some people say they don't need to go to college or they only need experience. Well, I, I need to go to college to do what I need to, to get done. So UB not only prepared me because of, you know, courses which are important, but it also, it, it also taught me how to, you know, not really articulate myself in a sense, but um, based on what it is that I need to do in terms of, you know, on a path to becoming an astronaut, I, I was able to, to publish papers at a very young age. I was able to manage a lot of different projects, which is very important in my field. Um, so it, it helped a lot. So there are two lecturers that came to mind and one course that came to mind. The two lecturers were Ms. Tombrista and Dr. Donko. Ms. Tombrista is the chairman of SMPT and Dr. Donko is the, the engineering teacher. Both of them, Ms. Tombrista never taught me, but well, in a class setting, but you know, they, Give me this this like real world application kind of thing, telling me what the real world is like out there, what I should do, what I shouldn't do. Um, thinking about life outside of the classroom, sure education is important, but what you need to do on a job is the class, the, the, the class that really that really was shed some light onto me is was Math 360, which was advanced probability. That's what that made me change my made me change my decision from being a robotics engineer to data science because probability is very important. <laughs> it's very important because um, when we have all of this data, we have a lot of data in the world, but we don't know what to do with it. And we don't know how to manage it. And when we manage it, we're not really managing it as effectively as possible. Yeah, we have the statistics. We could say what happened in the past, but like it's, it's a lot better when you could actually predict the future. Oh yeah, yeah, I couldn't think of anything that would have made my experience better. I've 
been to parties, I've planned parties, I've protested, I've been a part of a bunch of different clubs, organizations, I've volunteered, I've done so much what a college student should. <laughs> There's nothing I regret. I came here, I had fun, I'm graduating on time. And it's pretty good. I'm actually graduating um, with the highest GPA, one of my majors. Wow. Mm -hmm.